hello friends welcome to my youtube channel tech and hack today i am going to tell you how to calculate payroll or a salary slip so now let's start firstly we go to an excel sheet now open excel sheet now how to calculate so firstly we mention serial number then name of the employee okay then after basic salary after basic salary now calculate DA then house rent alliance and profit and fund now gross salary after gross salary EPF electronic profit and fund now LIC then after total deduction after total reduction final it means net salary so first of all the type it at one for making an uh, series number like in series number so now double click at there and fill it down now go to on that tab now fill series so it will go into 1 to 10 series now name of employer like James Adam Steven whatever you your employer name it's just for example after that down frame adjusting okay there is a sensitive smith Johnson Abraham now basic salary so just for example suppose basic salary of James is 5000 now it's for ten thousand, for fifteen thousand, for twenty thousand, thirty-five thousand, thirty thousand, thirty-five thousand. It's just for example. Now forty thousand, forty-five thousand, fifty thousand. Now how to calculate DA DA is related with basic basic salary DA is 10% of basic salary so now let's start how to cal now calculate DA so firstly click on the box now A is equals to is equals to select basic salary then multiply with 10 percent then enter so it will calculate 500 now calculate for all all the employee salary all the employee da so just click on double click on that area 
it will automatically calculate now hra hra is 7.5 percent of basic salary just for example so now is equals to select basic salary then multiply then 7.5 percent of hra then enter now calculate all the employee hra just going last one now double click on that area then it will automatically uh, then it will automatically calculate so now double click okay then after pf pf is 15 percent of basic salary so now calculate 15 percent then enter then calculate all the employee profit and fund double click on that area so it will automatically calculate all the employee profit and fund now gross salary gross salary is an addition of basic salary da hra and pf so if so now we calculate gross salary then select first employer row then go to on that area auto sum then select and click auto sum then it will calculate it now select this box and calculate all the employee salary gross salary now double click on this it will automatically calculate now epf epf is half of profit and fund so calculate for epf now going to is equals to select profit and fund then divided by 2 epf is half of profit and fund so we calculate is equals to gross salary is equals to gross salary and divided by 2 of profit and fund then enter to calculate uh, epf then select the row select the column now double click on that column it will automatically calculate all the employee epf now select lic lic is half of epf then we going to calculate lic so now is equals to select epf is half of lic is half of epf now then enter we calculate automatically now calculate for all those employee just select the column and double click on that so it calculate automatically for all the employees now double click now it's total deduction total deduction is related with epf or lic addition of epf or lic is called total deduction so now calculate select epf and lic and now go to auto sum so it will automatically add epf and lic and calculate total deduction so now click on that after calculating first employee total deduction then select the column and double click on that and so it will calculate automatically for all those employees now double click so calculate for net salary net salary is of net salary is calculated by gross salary minus total deduction 
net salary is calculated with subtraction of gross salary to total deduction so it will give a net salary so now go to is equals to select gross salary subtract or minus then select total deduction then now select total deduction then going to enter we will calculate net salary of the employee now select the column and double click on that so it will calculate all the employee net salary now going to double click so it will calculate all the employee salary now select whole data for make designing for attractive for attractive design I'll go to select border select all border and now go to at this for center I'm going to center okay I'm making format table now we just go to at that area select format table according to your choice I'm selecting this one now okay and it will come in new design for full design new design for removing the filter now select the row and now I'm going to con uh, press control shift and L to remove the filter now making for design for a company now right company name like XYZ private limited now select whole row and now go to merge at center it will go for center so now select it now for making for design just go fill color according to your choice now let's select this one now like I'm calculate for the month of June 2017 now select the whole thing like the whole row and now go to take and as for center now just click on mud at center and for fill color now just click on that and according to your choice you can fill any color of them I fill that now making and make making for border for more attractive so now select it and go with thick box border according to your choice now select thick and border so now it will cal and now we can calculate easily so now thank you and subscribe my channel and like and subscribe more and more thank you